All right. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to get my legs over the top and wrap his head and, and an arm, head and arm, because we had the head and arm before. But he's taken this out to hit me. All right. Okay. So when he's hit me here, he's obviously making a gap here. All right. So what I'm going to do, I'm kind of going to defend like as if. I'm defending the shots, which obviously I would be, because I don't want to just stay there and get smacked in the face, so I could get stopped. All right, so I'm just blocking like this, like you would. All right, this is quite a natural thing that I would do, so he's not suspecting anything at this point. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to kind of catch the arm, and I'm going to bridge just a little bit, just to get him slightly higher. All right, that's what we've found. If they're too low, you can't actually bring your legs over. And then what you're going to do is push the head and the arm away enough for your leg to come over here. All right, like that. Yeah, so I'm not overly great at this. I'll start on a video. But I'm going to go there, yeah? Sorry, Andy. Mate, that was right. awful. All right, so when we go to there, he could, you could actually push him down to here. All right, now it feels familiar to me. And I'm just going to, I'm just going to do it from here for a sec, because that was more or less what happened in the actual... Position. Yeah, but no one takes scarf up in the... In the fight, yeah? So just match them. They're like yeah. this. Okay, I'm blocking this up. All right, I'm just going to bridge this slightly, just get myself a bit further down, and I'm going to push the arm and the head away so I can get my leg through here and over the top of both. All right, so I'm going to kind of just, like as if I'm going to put my legs over my shoulder. All right, I'm going to bring this over, I'm trying to keep him in the face this time. All right, here, there, like that, and then I'm going to push away. I could push him down here, like this, and straight into, into here. All right, again, I'm straightening my leg at the bottom to wrap it like that, and that's definitely on for that point, yeah? yeah? All right, that first bit for me feels a little bit awkward, but obviously, um, uh, Liam McGeary from, uh, in the Bellator um, organization, he, he uh, used this in one of his fights, and he got this uh, submission from it, all right? And that is on our group um, page, if you want to uh, give that a look, and that's a lot better than this demo. All right, now then, um, I think also, that wasn't quite like that, all right? It was a little bit different. So this bit start bit was the same, all right? So here, all right, he was blocking this. And when he, when he got to here, all right, when he got this leg over, all right, which I'm really poor at, okay, Andy kind of tried to um, crush me down. So like, stack me like this, all right? And what happened then is he just come out the back like this, and then we're in this position again. So again, I can reach to here, catch my foot, straighten my top leg, all right? Cramp now, all right, like that, and then go to there. I can't do it, man. We'll cramp. All right, so this time he's not just going to fall over for me, he's going to actually try and stay on his all fours. All right, so I'm here, I'm blocking like that. I'm going to up just enough just to get him high, bring my legs over the top, try to kick him in the face, and he stacks me like this. But what happened? This is what happened, yeah? All right, what happened is you can bring yourself out the back like this, okay, to here. And then try to straighten your legs, wrap like this, and then you've got a submission there. And that is more or less what happened in the fight. <clears throat> okay, so 